so I kind of gave in today. Welcome to me organising my book cart. Round of applause guys, this has been a long time coming. I've wanted one of these for the longest time, let me tell you. And I've had no space because this room was just full of books everywhere and random assortments and it was not the vibe. But now I have this whole space behind me for the cart. And like this is like the best it's gonna get. So I'm thinking for the top portion, I want this to be like my immediate TBR. And then I'm thinking the bottom two because this has three sections. It says three sections, so I'm thinking immediate TBR, proofs, proofs. If you do not know what a proof is or an ARC, which you'll hear me throw those terms around a lot and it's okay if you don't haven't heard of them because you know, I don't think they're widely used terms if you are not amongst the book community. An advanced reader copy or proof is a book that is basically sent to the publisher early and given for release. I do have one around me. Yeah. For example, this is a proof copy. This is not a finished copy. So there'll be spelling mistakes. There'll be errors. They may have changed whole paragraphing. Um, normally then we might, if there's a map, there won't be a map in the proof. And it's basically sent out to publishers and influencers, reviewers before the book is finished, like actually available as it is in its like hardback form so that they can review it obviously to create some buzz around it if they liked it so yeah okay i'm gonna do the proofs first and then do my tbr because picking books out hard in glass house. okay proofs are in like all my larger print proofs are in so i will show you that now okay so we've got um all of basically i've tried to do them as best i can in publication order so we've got like jollof rice uh well wicked things gina brenthorn last tale of flower bride divine rivals happy place dragonfall perilous times fourth wing immortal longings girl goddess queen the sun and the void and then a shark cart so i'm gonna do the other side now this is as best as we're gonna get to be honest um because now all of my proofs that were in this box are now in here which is great oh my gosh i just had to run to the shop for my mother but we're back so i think now what i'm gonna do is maybe do series because there weren't as many i've also moved the proofs so the big proofs are down the bottom and i thought if i have stuff at the back like in this part i'm not gonna see it and i want to be able to see everything that's the whole point of this so like i don't mind having two stacks here because like that's fine but with the bigger ones because they are big i'm not gonna do so I'm thinking putting these series on there and then maybe like shatter me. I don't know. I'm thinking, yeah, these are definitely going to go on the shelf. Okay. Okay. So this is how it's looking. I've got my YA trilogies that I like. So, so we've got Inha the Inheritance Games, The Cruel Prince and Caraval. I need to read this. Fun fact, I found these two in a charity shop and one of you guys sent this to me, which I think is the coolest thing ever. So thank you. And then I've got Once Upon a Broken Heart and The Ballad of Never After, obviously the continuing series. And then these fit in here perfectly. The We Hunt the Flame, uh, We Free, We Hunt the Flame, We Free the Stars duology. So now this is going to be actual TBR, which is where the problems arise. Diet Coke break. Oh, shoot. It's going really, really well. So this is my immediate TBR. This, uh, we've got A Good Girl's Guide to Murder. This is for a reading vlog, but I need to get the rest of the series. I want to finish this, like, why is it shaking? I want to get the rest of this series, which is the Wolf Gone Wild series by Juliet Cross. Um, I did start reading these for a video and then I stopped and she's also changing the covers. So I need to get the rest of them. Uh, we've got Starling House, obviously. The I want to reread the Atlas Six. This is for my disc, potentially. Uh, obviously, Modern Divination. Lap Vona, which I am very intrigued by. I've heard a lot about and actually don't know what it's about. The Viraga Book of Witches and Ninth House for Spooky Season. And then the rest of the chatter me series because you guys probably are waiting on more vlogs for that so this is the tbr card i love it very much um it looks so nice and i might get like a little plant or something to put at the front to add a bit of pizzazz so yeah this is a really weird short video i hope you enjoyed i just wanted to sort my tbr card out with you